What's going on everybody? Welcome back. Today we've got the next MTV Pro Box in my new little studio S thing, if you will. Um, so, Otafo jersey, signed Bass Monopoly game. Figure this is a good place to kind of do MTB Pro unboxing. So, before any further ado, let's get into the June 2019 unboxing. That's not the Dibble. Dibble. That's not, that's not good either. There, there well, mm, yep, there we go. All right, so first up, uh, <clears throat> got a quick glance at this. Um, how does this compare to the last month? Um, Quality is here, just not my personal preference. That's what I'm gonna say right now. So first up, we have the Strike Pro Jumper 110 SP. Yep, and they say this goes for $12.99. Strike Pro, it is a jerk bait, um, which I think is really cool. I like um, suspending jerk baits. It's obviously a 110. It's got like a standard shad kind of look to it. Come on, look in on that bad boy. There we go. Uh, really like the color. I think the color's great with that nice little uh, gizzard shad top to it. Uh, two hooks, you know, just two, not this, the three. Uh, I do think this looks really, really nice. Um, that shimmer, a little bit of rattle to it. Or is that just the hooks? I think it might just be the hooks. No, it's got some rattles in it. Um, and it's suspending, so I'm a big fan of that. I like it. Uh, again, I, not something I want to throw a lot, but definitely something nice. Uh, I like you, I like you a lot. Down. Uh, next up, we have the Oct Optimum Boom Boom Line Through Swim Bait. Optimum Boom Boom. Um, cool. I mean, pretty pretty basic little swim through option here. Um, swim bait, I've seen a lot of these lately. <clears throat> um, saw it actually just the other day on uh, Major League Fishing actually, so that's cool. I'm not really sure who was throwing it, but uh, I like swim baits for the most part. I'm not gonna do the line through, but basically you drop a line through here, pops out here, and this is where this uh, it comes with this little treble hook. That's where this little treble hook goes. You tie to the treble hook out here, uh, and then it's just a basic swim bait, soft plastic swim bait. Um, doesn't feel like it can get really easily chewed up. It looks like you definitely use this for a while. Um, it's got a little piece of metal tubing here, it looks like. Well, plastic and metal. Uh, so it's got some weight to it, so it'll paddle real well. Um, it almost looks like it's a poured bait. Like, it's got the this flat top to it that's kind of got this concavity. I wonder if you guys can see this here. Um, and to me, that looks like it's a poured bait. Um, it gets poured into a mold, uh, which I'm really actually not a huge fan of. But, um, sorry, it was a mosquito. It was in my freaking basement. All right, um, not, not sure if I'm a fan of that, but you know, this is listed to be $9 flat. Um, to me, I would not buy this at $9. So it's just not a me thing. It might work great on your body of water, uh, but it's not a me thing. But I'm keeping, so normally you see me throw these things all around. I'm actually gonna keep all these and try and do an MTB Pro Slam. Um, um, possibly my next fishing video, we will see. There's a chance that I don't, just because there's not some of the stuff I want to throw right now in here. Uh, I want to throw top water. I want to do that kind of thing, um, and I'm going to possibly fish a river this weekend. So we'll see. I don't. I don't really know, but maybe, maybe we will. And guys, please comments, comments. What's so far your favorite one? Which one do you like more? This of these two? Do you like the jerk bait more? I do, personally. But I'm sure there's guys here that love swim baits. So I understand you. I love you anyway. It's okay. But, you know, meh, meh. All right, next up, we have Carl's Amazing Baits Golden Boy. This, actually, I do like a lot. Um, this is cool looking to me. I truly think that this actually does look nice. I, I think this one's decent. So, let's pull this bad boy out. Um, I will say this, Carl's has really stepped up their game. You know, this is just a, a little, was this, about a 2.5 square bill, 1.5 square bill, something like that. Um, I think it looks great. They've got some decent hooks on here. Um, not really sure the brand of the hook. It's hard to tell from just looking, but I think that's quite nice. Um, and I love this color. I think this is a great little color pattern. Uh, I love the red eyes that are on it. Nice square bill. Um, this isn't the, tr the one that you've been seeing. So like everybody and their brother's got like the Scheltz, uh, the Chinese knockoff essentially of the, f the square bill. But this one's good. It's a nice little square bill. So 
That's very convenient, very solid. Daddy likey. Uh, I was showing, they're saying $6.99. Um, this should probably be closer to like, uh, oh, $6.99 is not a bad price, but I'd say closer to five bucks. Uh, next up, we have the Lifted Jigs Flipping Jig. It's down here. So, I mean, we've got two hard plastic, or two hard baits, right? With the jerk bait and the square bill, and then a soft plastic-ish type swim bait. So, I mean, nothing bad here, guys. Nothing bad here. Uh, now we've got a jig. Everybody likes jigs. They munch the jigs. Um, they're calling this a 3 8 ounce flipping jig. Uh, I wouldn't call this a flipping. I mean, the angle that it's set at is a flipping jig uh, in like a peanut butter and jelly color scheme here, but not what I would call, man, it's really not gonna lock in on this, huh? Can you do that for me, please? There we go, a girl. A um, little bit of like almost PB, it's really just peanut butter. There's no jelly here, there's no purple. It's all just natural. Um, I'd like to see a wire tied jig here opposed to it's got just the little plastic rubber band. I'd, I'd like to see a little bit higher quality out of this jig. Um, but they do a good job with their coloring and everything, so I can't really complain too much. A little rough, um, but nice. All in all, pretty nice. Like I said, I'd like to see a wire tie, especially at this $4.99 price point. Um, and there's no soft there's nothing to attach this with. I like it when they give you like multiples. Like they give you this with a trailer. Right now it's just this that doesn't come with a trailer that I have seen here. So there's that. Uh, next up we have the Z-Man trick shots. Uh, these are just gonna be little drop shots. Nothing too crazy. I've got a ton of these in my boat. Um, I literally open this and it all falls apart. That's cute. But, and Z-Man, you know, they've got their super stretchy material. Um, cool color though, I like the color. Uh, it's gonna work really well in clear water, truth be told. Uh, really well in clear water. I don't know if it would work in dark, it's a little too light maybe, for dark colors, or for dark water. Um, but I do like it, I, I like Z-Man products. They're, I will say this, they do stuff that's not what everybody else does. Their things are outside of the box. I've gotta give it to them, they do a different type of plastisol, it's not even plastisol, it's something totally different. Um, so I, I gotta give it to Z-Man. They really kind of do some some pretty cool stuff. And we have another Carl's bait. Wow, we have two Carl's baits in the same box. Uh, this is for bullet weights. Those are half ounce bullet weights. Uh, you know what? Another thing about this box, no like sampler items really. Um, the closest thing to a sampler item has been that jig. Um, wow, this is ruthless. Let's, uh, let's try and cut my hand open here. That'd be a good idea, right? Wow, all right. So, we got some bullet weights. Ooh, these are really, we got five. Comes with five bullet weights, half ounce. These are a little on the long side for me. Um, I like the smaller ones. I'm betting these are probably lead. What's interesting is it doesn't say on it, it does say cancer. It's got a Prop 65 sticker. Um, so if you don't know what Prop 65 is, it means it contains lead. Uh, Prop 65 means it can really constitute anything that has lead in it. Uh, so these are gonna be little half ounce lead weights. That's why they are so large. I'd rather tungsten. I'm a tungsten guy. Uh, and plus I work with Wu Tungsten. So I'm probably not gonna use these. So if you want them, come pick them up. You can have them. Uh, all in all, oh, wait, wait, there's still a sticker. They always do good, I gotta give it to them, man. There's no catch co item. But boy, that sticker is pretty cool. Can you lock in on that, please? Why do you not lock in? There we go. Pretty cool sticker. Um, I appreciate it. All in all, I would give this like a 7 out of 10. Um, not because of the quality. The quality is here, okay? I just think, for me personally, there's only maybe two lures in this whole batch that I'm going to use. Uh, first and foremost, that's going to be this square bill. Uh, this, for me, is the money, money lure. Um, not worth the cost of this whole box, but this is what I'll be throwing most for sure. Shortly followed by the jerk bait. Um, I'm probably gonna actually use this jerk bait this weekend. Um, and I might throw the jig. I don't throw jigs enough. Uh, I really should throw jigs way more, but I'm pro I promise you I probably won't be throwing this except for 
the actual, um, if I try and do the MTB slams. So, all of it can go back in the box, and we can give it a shot. Um, yeah. More foosball videos coming here, guys, in the pipeline. Uh, more trips out on the boat. And uh, just make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I, I love doing these videos, and I can only do them if you guys really just keep watching and commenting, subscribing, and having a good time. Other than that, guys, hope you liked it. Until next time, happy foozing. Thank <laughs> you.